So here is the finished version of the BBC Microbit. Uh, it's finished in gold and black. The final production version will actually have some color silk screening on the front, but as a final prototype, this is what we have right now. So we have a 5.5 by 5 LED array across the middle here, and two user programmable buttons uh, that can be used in either orientation, whichever way you want to do that. You can see the microbit logo at the top. And then this bottom edge is an expansion interface, either for simple crocodile clip connectors. You can see we've got three IOs, 0, 1, and 2. We've got power and ground here. It would also take 4 millimeter banana plugs. So you can do makey-makey type uh, experiments with this. But you'll also notice the, the finer tooth connectors on here. So that will allow us to dock this into a expansion connector for either breadboard breakout experiments or for connecting into a housing or something else to extend the capabilities of the, of the micro bit. If we turn it over on the back, you can see uh, some of the silt screening here, the BBC logo. Uh, you can just about see some of these traces. So for the kids, we're educating them on where the processor is, where the Bluetooth uh, antenna is, etc. And the devices on the back that are notable, we have USB for connection to a PC for programming, and that will also take power. Uh, we also have an, a power socket to attach a uh, removable battery pack. And then this button on the back is the reset button once you've uploaded new code. So if I connect this now to a battery, So what we have on here is a simple um, <coughs> spirit level type application. It's just giving me an idea of where I need to move the device to. And if I get it right, it gives me a red tick. So that's just a simple piece of code using the accelerometer that's built into this device. Uh, it also has a magnetometer, so it can give you a good idea of the, um, its position uh, in the direction it's pointing in. So you can imagine the kids building applications for uh, knowing where they're going, uh, for trying to uh, measure how fast they're running, making a burglar alarm type device for their bedroom, sending a message. A key piece here is that it has Bluetooth low energy connectivity. So it will talk to a smartphone or a tablet, uh, either as uh, a tethered device, feeding data backwards and forwards, or we can actually do what's called photo or firmware over the air programming. So you can imagine kids on a bus scrolling messages to each other, using their phone to update the code and reflashing the device to send a different message. So there we have it. This is the BBC Microbit. It's being launched today, July the 7th, and every year seven child will be given one of these come the autumn, uh, the new term for 2015-2016.